Look at this. The sun is shining in London for a street style. I'm going to be stopping the best dressed guys to talk about what they're wearing and the grooming choices. Let's go. Jamie, I love this look. Where's everything from? Um, the This is my friend Mike owns Drake's on Savile Row and it's the most wonderful just wash silk linen cotton thing. I just throw on. This is Suit Supply. What people don't tell you on Savile Row, we all layer with cheaper places because yeah. It's not worth it. Um, Gatsyon and Girling shoes, Ralph Lauren Gurkha cargos, and uh, little neckerchief and drakes. Yeah. That's it, some old Tom Ford ones, because I've got a massive head. For guys watching, any top tips to style? Buy old stuff, 100% buy old stuff, and find a good tailor who can just cinch certain things in. Something made 30 years ago or more, 25 years, a long time before private equity gets involved in fashion in a big way and starts this wanting bigger margins. My biggest advice, you don't need to spend a fortune. Lucas, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Yeah, yeah I like this look, kind of transitional, great white trousers. Yeah. Yeah. Just vintage Levi's. Uh, this is APC that I got online as well, like, like second hand. Yeah. This is from our store and this is in Shepherds. Yeah. And then some trainers, like some like German army trainers. Yeah, yeah. and some bags because I'm just going to Brighton. That's okay. <laughs> Yeah. A weekend away. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You spoke about picking up some sort of secondhand pieces there. Yeah. Do you have a favorite place to go for that? Uh, I'd say eBay, Vestiaire Collective. Yeah. Uh, even that bag is like vintage Hermes. I like this. Darker colors, but with the sunnies. Perfect yeah, for this weather. I, I couldn't make a decision today, yeah. so I just uh, went, went uniform in one color. And, uh, yeah. yeah, I like it. And where is everything from? Everything is from Simon Armour, tailoring house in Stockholm. Yeah. Uh, they're just opening on Albemarle Street in okay. two weeks' time. Yeah. Um, yeah, really good guys. Sunglasses, they also from there? Uh, no, these I got from Clutch Cafe. You smell incredible. Do you have a favorite oh, yeah. fra a fragrance for this? I'm a slight fragrance addict, so I have, I don't know, 10, 15 of them. But this is Tain Noir from uh, Le Labo, which weirdly was my ex-girlfriend's fragrance. Then she left it <laughs> behind and I adopted it. <laughs> I've had a few questions about fragrance on here, and I do actually ask the guys what fragrance they're wearing, but it's on Street Sense. It's on Instagram and TikTok, man from self. Go and see it. Uh, tell me, where's everything from? Um, it's a bit of everything, to be honest. Uh, this is like um, a charity shop. This is Kaha. Um, this is uh, No Faith. It's a brand from Germany. The Martin Rose and Nike. And the glasses ASOS. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, very good. I like this shirt over shirt. This is working. What gave you the inspiration for this? I don't know. It's just come in my hands and I just do two pieces and try and then it works. Paul, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You look great. Really Thank cool. You. Yeah. Where's everything from? So the jacket is from Sandro. Then this is just a like, little cardigan from Su Suit Supply. Mm -hmm. And the trousers are from Reese. And the shoes, I don't really know where they're from. Yeah. And you're German? Yes, I'm German, yeah. yeah. Where about? Uh, from Hamburg in Germany. Okay. Yeah. What do you find different about the style in London versus Hamburg? In Hamburg, everyone is quite like monotone, but in London you have like, because of all the different areas and how big the city is and the cultures, everybody dresses somewhat different and people are a bit more brave about what they're wearing. Giving you a rundown of my outfit. I'm gonna start from the bottom and work to the top. I've got my Birkenstocks, which I'm living in this season. Super comfy and seem to work with most things. The trousers are Mr. P by Mr. Porter. This shirt, I've had it for a couple of years. It's H&M, oversized. It was gonna go on my Vinted. I might put it on my Vinted. The vest is Hugo Boss. Uh, this bag actually came with a whole lot of Sasha Wan products. And I decided it was good for a street styled. Into my hair, it's my products. I'm using Amphor Texture Volume Spray. Sea salt spray with loads of texture. If you don't know about this product, I'll link it down below. And then a little bit of my clay. I actually put that on top of the sea salt spray and worked it in. Essentially, my hair needs a good cut, so I wanted something to hold it down. And my watch is from Tudor. And again, as with all the looks you've seen, we'll know everything down below in the description and find some links for you. Chris, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, first important question, are you a model? Uh, no, I get that a lot, but I'm, I'm not actually, yeah. Okay, well, we're going to get Chris's Instagram if you are a modeling agency. Seriously, you look incredible. Thank yeah, you. where's everything from? Um, this is Dirk Bickenberg, just yeah. a regular polo. This is just like a long sleeve black sleeve, I think from Uniqlo, actually. Yeah. They've got loads of good yeah. basics. This is 
A Canadian designer called Joshua Jamal. Okay. I got that from him a couple months ago. These trousers I made Did myself. You? Okay. Yeah. yeah. It's like, I don't even study uh, sewing or yeah. menswear formally or anything. I just yeah. made it because I was bored. I love that. And then these shoes are from Jeremy Scott. Yeah, Jeremy Scott. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, they're my favorite shoes at the moment. Yeah, I've been wearing them good. a lot. Talking grooming, do you have any favorite products? Oh yeah, Korean, Korean. skincare. Um, like, Cor I think it's Corsix, I think. Corsorex? Yeah, that's, yeah. yeah, I love using that because I work at TK Maxx as well. Okay. So that's why I was on the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they usually have like a bunch of their stuff. So like, a lot of the girls have put me onto that kind of stuff. And like, I use their, their sunscreen yeah. and like the snail. Snail mucin, yeah, and the yellow, yeah. I love it's that, great. yeah, it's really yeah. good. I like your look. Thank you, yeah. yeah. Where's everything from? Um, so this is from a charity shop. Mm -hmm. I think it's from Primark though. And then these are weekday jeans. And then I got these loafers from a charity shop as well. Yeah. And the same with this denim jacket. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Um, and the jewelry, I'm just seeing the rings, they're cool. Yeah, so I got a couple of these from my nan, um, including this. Grooming, your hair looks cool. Any favorite products? <laughs> um, yeah, I use this texturizing cream from Fish, I think. Yeah. Which works pretty well yeah. for me, in, yeah. In the white tub. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I know it well. I know my fish. So, question for you. Are you enjoying this? If so, and you've not yet pressed subscribe, then what are you doing? Press subscribe right now. Josh, nice to meet you. Me too. Cool. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Do you work in fashion? I do, yes. Okay. Who do you work for? I work for a German brand just around the corner called LFDY. Okay. Um, but I've always I've worked in Soho for a while as well, so okay. I kind of pick up the, the fashion tendency. Yeah, you That's most cool. certainly have. I love thank this look. Is you. everything from that brand? Um, I'm wearing like a waffle knit from them, wearing the shorts, but I always put my personal style on. Yeah. So I've got my loafers on, some nice stacked grey socks, and yeah. then um, like this archive Susie piece as well. Bleaching your hair, like how often do you have to do this? Um, What's the upkeep? The upkeep is like once a month. Yeah. I've done normally like grow it out, cut it, and then like. I grow it out again, mm -hmm. cut it, and then dye it mm -hmm. because it's doing it too too often. Yeah. It just damages my scalp. Yeah. And do you use like toners or silver shampoos? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do toners because um, it's summer now, and obviously, like I'm gonna be wearing less hats in the yeah. summer. I'll be doing uh, a lot more playful styles as well, yeah. coloring it, or get like cheetah print and stuff like that all over. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Akmal, nice to meet you. Yeah, hi, hi. Yeah, okay. look at this. A vision. You. you were actually kind of like glistening towards me in the sun, and I thought I need to talk to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love this look. Also, similar shirts. Similar shirt. I'm on trends. Seriously. <laughs> uh, where's everything from? Um, okay. Um, this is from Supreme. Oh, okay. And then we've got Pata. And then underneath we've got Polo, Ralph Lauren, some Kelvin Klein, and then Pillars, and a Cos back. Okay. Yep. Very good. And the cap? A uh, cap is from Amy Leondore. Right Actually, I just purchased it yesterday. Did you? Yeah. Okay. One of those like purchase, wear, go. Exactly. Yeah, like that. Okay, this bag is a good size, but it's so annoying. It keeps on falling off my shoulder. Like that during the interviews. No. I love these looks. We've kind of got a bit of sort of the same print, but different colors. Great. Was this on purpose? <laughs> different fonts. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. This is from Vinted. Okay. <laughs> um, these pants are from a friend. Okay. And I, and I never gave them back. Okay. Yeah, nice. And then these shoes I found in a giveaway box. Oh, wow, okay, yeah, good yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what brand the top is? I don't know, actually. So what we got? Primark? Oh, no, God. No. Okay, okay. Well, we won't That's fine. But it's, that it's, it's, from, it's from Vinted. Rewind. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Rewind. <laughs> That's fine, you're it, making it, it work. Vintage, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, sunglasses, what have we got? These are just from my oh, normal glasses. Oh, wow, okay, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, find a pair of glasses that can do both. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it's like a real reveal. <laughs> you got anything else you can show us? Yeah. Not on the camera. Not on the camera. <laughs> okay. We'll move on to Nathan. Um, tell me about your look. Yeah, this is uh, from a company called Brixton from my hometown in Encinitas, California. Yeah. Um, which is where he lives now. So I, okay. I didn't realize that it was named after a place, but it's okay. from Brixton. Uh, I think that these are just from Urban Outfitters. These shoes from something called, I think, Cloud. Okay. I don't remember what they're called. And they look comfy. They are comfy. Yeah, yeah, they're great. Peter, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Very cool. Thank you. Yeah, I love this whole look. Thanks so much. Where's everything from? Uh, this is uh, Fred Perry. Mm -hmm. I got one from in Japan. Yeah. This is, I think, it's Japanese brand, but I'm not sure. My my father gave it to me. Okay. And this belt is from Gucci. This trousers from, uh, I think, Brioni. Yeah. The shoes are from Prada. 
Yeah, it's like... And the sunglasses also oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. It's all Gucci, yeah. Gucci, yeah. yeah. Well, this is Dominic. It's Dominic's birthday. Yes, Halsey yeah. and his son. It's yesterday, sorry. Yeah. He's taking us to get some R.M. William boots. I like that. Um, are these R.M. Williams? These are. Yeah, 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 they are. So I got them in Australia, big Australian brand. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I love that. And where's everything else from? I'll start with you, Halcyon. Uh, this is ma mainly Abercrombie. So I've got a, this jacket and top. Um, and then these are Levi jeans. Yeah. Nice. Very good. Dominic, these very suave. My own brand, yeah. uh, Dominic St. Paul, which is a shop in Saigon. Yeah. And then um, tailor made suit in Savile Row. Um, and uh, sunglasses from Serengeti. Street Styled, you have been very kind to me. The guys and the weather, as ever, all linked down below. And if you've not yet pressed subscribe, then please do press subscribe right now. But until my next new video, the sun is shining. Bye-bye.